Hey everyone, I'm Brian Benzin with Let's Make Effects, and today I'm going to show you how to get evenly distributed particles uh, along your shape in Niagara. So uh, first things first, you're going to create a new Niagara system. I utilized the uh, omnidirectional burst template, and I just deleted a bunch of stuff I didn't need. So we'll start here. Uh, we're going to go to the plus sign next to particle spawn, and we're going to search for set, because we're going to set a new parameter. And that parameter is going to be a float. So we're going to hit the plus sign here and search for float. Uh, and hit enter, and we're going to right click that new float, and we're going to rename it execution index. And so execution index is the order with which the particles are spawned. And so um, we can search from this drop down, we can get that information uh, by searching for exe, and we want returned normalized execution index. So this is the order with which the particles are spawned, normalized, so it's between 0 and 1. And uh, now we're set up to, uh, to utilize that value to spawn particles on our shape evenly distributed. So we're going to hit the plus sign next to particle spawn, and we're going to search for shape location. And uh, the, the, the easiest way to, to showcase this is on a ring. And so by default, the particles are spawned randomly on that ring, as you can see. Uh, but instead of utilizing random, we're going to do direct set. And here in the U position, we're going to utilize that, that particle spawn order such that as the particles are spawned, they're evenly distributed along this, uh, the, the, uh, the, the shape uh, position. So uh, if we grab our execution index and we drop that in our U shape, you'll see that now particles are spawned evenly distributed along the shape. 